Hello, I'm Brian Fitzgerald, the Golf Doctor, and today I'm going to talk about how to care for the grips on your golf club, probably the most neglected part of your club. Stay tuned. So, the reason I'm doing this tip today is this morning I had a client come to me for a golf lesson and he had his clubs in beautiful condition. He just cleaned them prior to the lesson. They were looking absolutely fantastic, nice and shiny. All of the dirt was removed from the grooves. He had them absolutely perfectly. Except for this end, it was the grip was as shiny as anything. I think I could have done my hair in the in the, the reflection on the grip. The grip was so shiny. It wasn't that he neglected or did anything wrong. It's the UV rays react with the polymers in the grip and over time they get shiny. So I said to him, when was the last time you washed your grips? And he said, I've never washed my grips. He always washes his clubs after every round, but he never ever washes his grips. So that's the first thing. I would try and wash your grips maybe once every two weeks. Just a simple scrubbing brush, a bit of soap, scrub all, the, uh, all of the grip there, rinse it off with uh, nice clear water, get a towel, lightly towel it dry and let it air. And in about 10 minutes, the grip should be tacky. However, sometimes just due to the UV rays reacting with the polymers in the grip, as I said, the grip does go shiny. So what you need to do then is you need to get some sandpaper. So here I've got 240 grip sandpaper, but it doesn't really matter. And all we need to do is go over the grip be careful not to get the shaft, particularly if you've got graphite shafts, and we just go over the grip, sanding all of that, and what will happen is over, as you do that, the shininess will go away, and you'll get back to a nice, uh, it'll be slightly rough, but not too rough, but you'll get rid of all of that shininess. After you've done that, then wash your grips, and do it the same way as I said before. Warm water, soap, scrubbing brush, give it a good, um, a, a good wash, Lightly towel it dry, let it air, and in about five minutes, you'll find that grip is super tacky. So then, when you have a nice tacky grip, your hands can actually do what they're supposed to do. If the grip is shiny, it's slippery and slick, you have to grip the club too tightly. And we've already discussed what happens if you have a tight grip. So you want to grip it as light as you possibly can, and you can only do that with your grips in good condition. So by all means, pay, it, pay attention to cleaning this end of the club, but really, this end of the club is more important. So 240 grit sandpaper, you can use 120, something in that range is good. Uh, you should, probably should sandpaper every three months or so, but certainly wash your grips every two to three weeks and you'll find you'll get a lot more life out of the grip. You don't need to go and spend another 10 to $15 getting a new grip. Recondition the old one and you'll be fine. I hope you've enjoyed the tip. I'm Brian Fitzgerald, The Golf Doctor. If you like my videos, you can subscribe by pressing the button down there. You can also get further information on my Facebook page or my Twitter page, or you can sign up for my electronic newsletter at thegolfdoctor.com dot com dot au